I'm Johan Bledson and welcome back to my channel Joe's Learn. Today I will be talking about how to round off numbers to the nearest tens. So let's get started. understand how to round off numbers to the nearest tens. So for that we need to first look at the digit in the ones place. If the digit in the ones place is lesser than 5, that is 1, 2, 3 or 4, then we have to round downwards or we have to round to the tens that is before that number. But if the digit in the ones place is greater than 5, or equal to 5, then we have to round upwards. Or we have to round to the tens that is after that number. So first let's try rounding off the numbers to the nearest tens using two digit number examples. My first two digit number example is 75. As I said earlier, we need to first look at the digit in the ones place. And so in this case, 5 is in the 1's place. So in this, it's showing that we need to round upwards. So we need to round that this number to the 10's that is after the number. So the 10's that is after this number is 80. So 75 rounded off to the nearest 10's equals to 80. Now let us try with this example that is 30. In this example, again, we need to look at the digit in the 1's place. In this case, 2 is in the 1's place. So, we have to round downwards. And so, we have to round this number to the 10's that is before the number. So, the 10's that is before this number is 30. So, 32 rounded off to the nearest 10's equals to 30. Now let's try with this example. We have to look at the digit in the ones place. 9 is in the ones place. And as 9 is greater than 5, we have to round this number to the tens that is after that number. So the next tens after this number is 100. So 99 rounded off to the nearest tens equals 200. If you want to round off a number to the nearest tens in an easier way, I will show you a method. So for this method, we need to first look at the digit in the ones place. So let's try again these examples using this easy method. So again, you have to look at the digit in the ones place. 5 is in the ones place. So it is shown here that we need to round upwards. Instead of finding the tens that is after this number we need to just do put zero in the ones place and add one to seven or the digit that is in the tens place so seven plus one eight and in the ones place zero so it will become as eight now the next example is 32 so we have to look at the digit in the ones place two is in the ones place so it's shown here that we need to learn down because it is a number which is lesser than 5. So, to put a 0 in the 1's place and not change anything in the 10's place. Just leave it as it is. That is, so 32 rounded off to the nearest 10's will result in a number that is 30. Now, let us try with this 99. So, we need to look at the digit in the 1's place. So, 9 is greater than 5. So, we need to round upwards. So we have to put a 0 in the 1's place and add 1 to 9 in the 10's place. So if we add 1 to the 9 in the 10's place, then that will result in 10. So 10, 0, 100. So 99 rounded off to the nearest 10's equals to 100. So now let's try with 3 digit number examples and 4 digit number examples. So, first example is 197. So, in this we need to first look at the digit in the 1's place. 7 is in the 1's place. So, to put a 0 in the 1's 
place an add one to the digit in the tens place as it is rounding upwards. But if we add one to nine, then it will be equal to ten. So we need to carry over one to the digit in the hundreds place. So one hundred and ninety-seven rounded off to the nearest tens equals to two hundred. Now let's we'll start with this number that is 841. In this number, we should look at the digit in the ones place. So one is in the ones place. So one is a number which is lesser than five. So we have to only put a zero in the ones digit, leaving the other place so that is hundreds or any other place that is before it the same as it is. So 841. Rounded off to the nearest tens equals to 840. Now let's try with this number that is 1086. So for this again we have to look at the digit in the one space. 6 is in the one space and as 6 is a greater number than 5, we have to round upwards. So to put a 0 in the one space, and add 1 to the digit in the tens place. So 8 plus 1, 9. And you have to leave the rest of the places as it is. So 1086 rounded off to the nearest tens equals to 1090. Now we have understood that if we want to round off a number to the nearest tens, we need to first look at the digit in the ones place. So if that digit which is in the ones place is lesser than 5, then we need to put a 0 in the ones place, leaving the digits which are in the other places before that number the same. But if the digit in the ones place is greater than 5, that is any number of the 5, 6, 7, 8 or 9, then you have to put a 0 in the ones place and add 1 to the digit in the tens place. So in this way, we can round off a number to the nearest tens. I hope you understood this concept. If you didn't subscribe my channel, please subscribe now. And also enable the bell icon to get notifications on my latest videos. Bye friends! Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more interesting videos.